Hello, welcome to the cutting board. My name is McKinnon Griffin, and today we're going to cook white spinach with spinach, and but that name is just horrible. Well, you know what? We'll call it the Dirty Blonde. To continue our Italian theme night, we're going to get some French bread. Second thing, we're going to use spinach. Third, green onion, garlic, and extra sharp cheddar cheese. Now, let's get started. Now, what you want to do is when you cut the bread, is you want to cut it in the middle and then in half, like I have done here. These are both connected at one point. Next is you want to grab your spinach. Lay that down first. Let that be the foundation on top of the bread so that all the other things, when you're cooking it and it's melting, will all fall on top of the spinach. Next thing you want to do is grab yourself some green peppers. Green peppers, are, I think, are one of my favorite... Uh, Green onions, excuse me. The green onions are one of my favorite uh, onions. They have a lot of flavor, and they don't take up your entire refrigerator, and they last forever. I bought one like two weeks ago, and I'm still using it today. Now, once you have it nice and cut up, you just sprinkle that around. It adds a lot of flavor to it. There you go. Next, you want to grab your garlic. For any Italian dish, no, 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 too much garlic? That's not a thing. Just cover that bad boy with some garlic. There we go. Now, after we've done that, we're going to get our nice extra sharp cheddar cheese. The ch the, well, you only get the extra sharp because it'll melt better, better than the normal sharp. So, just cut that. Place it on top. I really want that. To get it that nice dirty blonde look, you want to get a lot of that cheese over it on top of it. So don't skip out on the cheese. And one more, one more. I should do it. Place that in right there. That is a dirty blonde and a very quick appetizer to make. After you put this all on the bread, you're going to want to preheat your oven to 200 degrees and just as before, put it into the oven for 15 minutes. In 15 minutes, the bread will be crunchy, the cheese will be melted, and it will just look fantastic. Now, that is the Dirty Blonde. I'm McKinnon Griffin. This is The Cutting Board. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Jeff Ramsey.